welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Mackenzie. It is very nice to meet you. Um, and today I'm going to do a back to school makeup look. Um, this is the look right here. Um, I've worn this look for years. It's one of my favorite makeup looks to do. I've done it from like freshman year all the way to college. I wore this look pretty much every day last year um, if I was ma wearing makeup for class, if I felt like it. Um, I can do this makeup look pretty fast and I do it pretty fast in the video so I'm sorry if it's too fast for you guys. Um, let me know down below and maybe I can slow it down a little bit for you guys. Um, but I just wanted to give a school look that like isn't too dramatic because on the first day of school even you don't want to wear like too much makeup and then like that's the bar you set for the rest of the year. Like everybody's like oh she's always gonna like look nice. Um, so this is like a makeup look where you have pretty much a full face. Um, I'm not wearing foundation, um, but I'm pretty much wearing everything else. You have like a full face, but it looks more natural and my eyes aren't like crazy. Um, especially like if you're like trying to set the bar, you know, like it's the first day, like what, what's everybody going to look like? What's like the trends for this year? Kind of like, don't want to go too far. Um, but this is also a makeup look that, like, I feel like junior high kids could probably pull together all the way to, like I said, I use it in college. Um, I used a lot of drugstore options, but I know, like, all the high-end options I use, there are dupes for, and I will try to link those below if I remember. Um, if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button down the... I can't even speak. Down below, because I'd really like you guys to come back and join the community here on my channel. Also give this video a thumbs up if you are um, into these back to school videos. Um, I would really appreciate that. And without further ado, let's hop into the video. Alrighty, we're gonna get started. My coffee here. We're gonna be ready for this back to school look. So the only thing I have on, ignore my dogs are like right here. So if you can see them, ignore them um so all I have on is um all I have on right now is moisturizer I use the Clinique uh, moisturizing gel for oily skin um that's all I have on and we're just gonna start with um concealer so I go back between this one which is the covergirl clean skin concealer and um the naked um concealer from Urban Decay. So I'm just using this CoverGirl one to give you kind of like a drugstore option. If I look right here, like there's a mirror right in front of me so that I actually am applying this, you know, pretty good for school. My Fitbit just went off. Um, so I have worn this concealer ever since I started wearing concealer. Um, and it works for me. It's a great drugstore concealer. And I like wands to apply concealer. I don't know. I just like them. And I don't really wear foundation a lot. So this is a great um, concealer because it's very light coverage. But like it can also build it. Um, and I don't wear foundation. So... So then I'm just using my beauty blender to blend this in. This is actually a Real Techniques beauty sponge. So I just blend that all in. And then I usually just move on to eyes. Again, I can do this look really fast if it's just me in the morning. Um, okay, I'm taking the... MAC Paint Pot and Bare Steady. This is my favorite paint pot. Since I'm explaining this look, it's going to take me a little longer than usual. But this is a really fast look. So then I just go in with the Naked Palette from Urban Decay. And I'm going to pick up the color Sidecar and I'm just going to use my finger. And this is just going to go all over my eye. Probably have this exact look somewhere on my channel because I used to wear it all the time. It's probably like one of my like everyday makeup videos, but I have changed it up a little bit. 
So then I'm just going to take a blending brush and pick up the color Buck City. Stop, stop. My dog is like licking away. And I'm just going to pop this into the crease. Kind of messily. And then I'm just going to take a like clean blending brush and blend that out. And then I'm going to take my Real Techniques. Oh, it's rubbed off. This brush from Real Techniques and pick up the color Toasted. And I was going to take that on the outer edge of my eye to kind of like smoke things up a little bit. You can skip this step if you just want more of like a, you know, quick look. And then I'm just going to take that blending brush and just kind of blend all that together. Then I'm going to pick up a little bit more of Sidecar and just kind of dab that. And then I'm going to take the brush right out of the Naked palette. I'm going to pick up the color Virgin and take that right under my brow bone. And then I'm going to pick up Sin and take that into my inner tear duct. And then before I put this palette away, I'm going to go through my brows with a spoolie. This is just the e.l.f. spoolie if you want to know which one I use. Now this is a step I don't do every day, um, but I will do it if I'm using this palette because I use the color Naked. Um, and So I would definitely usually do it if I'm using this palette because it's really handy to just fill in my brows. This isn't a step I would do every day for school though, if I'm like trying to be really fast. Again, like I said, I can do this look pretty fast if it's just me and I'm not explaining it. So now I'm just going to grab my eyelash curlers. As you see, that eye look was like extremely quick. You just like throw some makeup on your eyes and blend it out. And as long as you blend it, I mean, thank you. Then I'm going to take the Clinique High Impact Mascara. I just have like a little sample size I'm trying to use up. Finished eyes. I hope that wasn't like too extremely fast for you guys, but like I said, I've been doing this look forever. So now for bronzer, I'm going to take my Everyday Bronzer, which is the Rimmel natural bronzer. I'm taking my e.l.f. powder brush. And this isn't really like a contour. This is literally just like to bronze my face. I don't ever contour really and especially not for school. I just like why well, take the time? And this is the lightest color. This is sunshine. So, you know, if you're not trying to have a super, like, ooh, she's definitely wearing bronzer look. This is a good one because it's just very natural. So then I would usually use MAC's Style Blush, but for a good drugstore option, I'm using the e.l.f. blush in Tickled Pink, which is a great, um like peachy pink color. I like this color. Um, but like for my everyday makeup, I usually use Style by MAC. But this one works as well. It's just not as pigmented, I guess. And then I usually will wear highlight. You can skip that step um, if you want. I'm using MAC's Soft and Gentle for highlight. the step or just do like a very like naturally look 
For lips, I don't like to wear lipstick to school because it comes off and then you have to reapply it. And I'm just, I'm not about that. So I'm using my favorite chapstick. This is the Vaseline Lip Therapy and Cocoa Butter. I love this one. I keep it in my book bag at all times. And it's great. It smells really good. But they have a bunch of different ones. So they have like an aloe one. They have like an original one. I just like the cocoa butter one because it smells really good. So that was my super fast back to school makeup look. This is like literally the finished product. Like I said, I can do this look. I think I've tied myself and I've done this whole look in under five minutes before. Um, in the mornings I would like to time myself. I'd be like... Okay, I can do this in less than five minutes, and I would like look at the clock and see how fast I could do it with like it still looking good. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This again is a great makeup look for all ages. I still wear it, I wore it pretty much um, on and off from freshman year to senior year. Um, and I still love it so it's really natural it's great for the first day of school I think because it's not too dramatic um, but still wearing makeup and you're still looking good for the first day if you are not subscribed please hit that subscribe button down below so that you can see more videos like this and please give this video a thumbs up if you would um, and I will see you guys in my next video thanks for watching bye